It is a problem that happens literally next door in too many communities here in central New York. Meth busts, people making methamphetamines, and the area's police and law enforcers trying to catch up with this. Now they're getting some help from perhaps an unusual source. Meet Joe Smith, who is the chief of the Oneida Indian Nation Police. It's a dangerous drug. I mean, there's no doubt about that. Mm -hmm. What is it that this training will give you, do you hope, yeah. chief, that will help your officers handle it better? Well, uh, several things. First of all, the recognition of the drug itself. Um, if we stop vehicles and it, it has a substance in it that could be methamphetamine, we want our police officers to be ahead of the game and to understand what it is. Uh, secondly, if we uh, end up going to a meth lab um, uh, that's constructed somewhere uh, in or around our Indian country, we want to make sure that our officers are prepared to understand what the drug is, uh, to be cognizant of the dangers involved in uh, investigating this crime. Because it can be a death trap, quite frankly. It can be a death trap. Uh, they, can, they can explode. They can burn. Uh, inhaling the fumes can be very dangerous mm -hmm. to our police officers mm -hmm. and to anybody else who's at the scene. You are holding mm -hmm. this training seminar for your force, but you've invited other people in also to come, come take advantage of it. Well, we have. Um, <clears throat> We believe that with the cooperation of the other police departments in our area that we can have a better handle on fighting this drug as it comes into our area. And you are not actually doing the course yourself. You're getting some help from the feds, right? We're not. We are federal police officers. The United Indian Nation Police Department are federal police officers. And we have reached out to Homeland Security uh, for assistance in this training. Uh, they got a hold of, they have a, a bureau called the Rural Policing Institute. Mm -hmm who is coming to our headquarters and presenting this training for us. You're at the um, effect end of this, essentially. Is there any prevention component to this? Are, are you working at that part, too? Uh, the prevention, I think, is the recognition by uh, each and every one of us that this does exist, and that if, in fact, um, a parent or a school teacher or uh, someone in authority recognizes that one of their students or one of their uh, child care workers or is involved in any of this stuff, please give your local police department a call. This is uh, for area police agencies. It's not open to the public. Um, if you want more information, though, on the Oneida Nation Police, here is a website. Hope you've learned something this morning.